you're locked in with the innovators. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell. How do people in your family react to you when you first start getting into music and all that? They supported it? Uh, I ain't gonna count. It was like, I used to tell my, my mama, like, she used to invest in me, like, pay for, like, my clothes and shit. Some of my studio sessions. Like, she was with shit because it was like, I, didn't, I couldn't go back to high school. I got shot getting out of school, but... Yeah. And then, like, I was going to a school called LMI, and then I finally finished that bit, and I tried to go back to a regular high school. Yeah. And they were like, shit, we can't take the read and write, but you can't come back, like, type shit. Yeah. I was like, damn, what the fuck? They were like, you in the gang, and you a leader of a gang, and some more whole extra shit. I'm like, damn. I was, basically, my mom knew it was over with. Like, yeah. that shit was over with. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So that one, not, that one, that one like, rapping really picked up for me. Yeah. Yeah. What was it that got you into music? I've been rapping since I was little, like, Nine, eight, like been rapping, like, you know what I mean? like what, at that age, like, like real studios, like in the studio, real? yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, who, my cousins, who got you into the studio, and that was just something you wanted my, to do. My cousins, my big, well, my cousin's daddy, okay, Paul, like, big Richard Rich. We had a group called Big Knowledge, and we made our first song about our grandma who passed away, yeah. and that shit was like in 2000, probably like 10, 9, or some shit like that, like 9, 10, something like that, yeah, yeah, I got you. Um, in your opinion, what's your biggest song right now? Uh, probably when I see you, really, yeah. When I see you down there, thirty million, hell yeah. Nah, nah, uh, voodoo. Nah, cause when I see you, like that shit impacted the world. Yeah. Yeah, that shit impacted. Everybody was singing that. Yeah. yeah, not real shit. Um, how would you say the coronavirus affected you? It did. Well, it did. I made a lot of money through the COVID, but my mama caught COVID too, so yeah. that shit fucked my head up. Cool though. And she good now, yeah. like she like she like I guess she in the last phases of that shit. You yeah. know what I'm but that's about it. But COVID, like that shit, really like made me more money. You know what I'm saying? I was in the studio mode, working more. You know what I'm saying? It really ain't really stop shit for me. Yeah. To be honest. How you feel about the vaccine? I don't know. I don't really know. I get it if I like if I have to, but I ain't really. I ain't really into no shots and shit. Yeah. yeah. Nah, I I had caught COVID like a month ago or like a month and a half ago. I ended up getting the first shot. I think it was a hella nurse. I didn't want to get it, but for real, my family was like, if you want to come home for Thanksgiving, you got to get the <laughs> shot. <laughs> Damn, that's fucked up, that's fucked boy. fucked up. <laughs> On game. Um, 